<laughs> Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Toddler Time. My name is Miss Katrina. I'm the children's librarian here at the Northboro Free Library, and we are still doing virtual programming this fall. So you are here for the fall session, and today... Let's see, every toddler time, we make a prediction about what our story time is about based on the covers and the titles of our books. So I'm gonna show you our books and I want you and your grown up to try to guess what our story time is about today. So the first I have is called At the Beach and this is by Harlequell. And who do you see on the cover? Who's that? A little girl. What's she holding? She's holding a bucket. What is she following? Oh, a bird. That might be a sandpiper. Looks like a sandpiper. And what's this? What's that big blue thing? Oh, the ocean. I even see a boat way back there. Okay, so at the beach. And we have a book called Here comes ocean and who's that boy what is he carrying he's bucket too and he has a friend with him who's playing in the a puppy and this is by meg fleming so can you tell me what every time is about today we've got at the beach and here comes ocean you can make a guess with your grown-up. I bet you got it. That's right. We're talking about the beach. That is my favorite place in the whole world to be is at the beach. My favorite. Have you gone this summer? Or do you remember going to the beach before? Hmm. We'll chat about it in a little bit. But before we do that, we're going to do our opening song. So everybody stand up. Stand up. Grown-ups, you too. Sing along with me. It's a really easy song. And it goes like this. Come along and sing with me. Sing with me. Sing with me. Come along and sing with me. It's so much fun to sing. Let's jump. Come along and jump with me. Jump with me. Jump with me. Jump with me. Come along and jump. With me, it's so much fun to jump. Can you nod your head? Come along and nod with me, nod with me, nod with me. Come along and nod with me, it's so much fun to nod. Can you stomp your feet? Let's stomp. Come along and stomp with me, stomp with me. Stomp with me, come along and stomp with me. It's so much fun to stomp. Let's spin around. Come along and spin with me, spin with me, spin with me. Come along and spin with me. It's so much fun to spin. Can you blink your eyes? Come and blink with me. Blink with me, blink with me, come along and blink with me, it's so much fun to blink. Can you clap your hand on us, you too, clap, clap. Come along and clap with me, clap with me, clap with me, come along and clap with me, it's so much fun to clap. Good job, nicely done. All right, everybody, hands on shoulders, hands on knees. Now hide them behind you, if you please. Reach up high into the air. Now down at your sides, touch your hair. Can you find your elbows? Here they are. Now squash your feet. Now wiggle your fingers on the place. Stomp your feet and turn around. Stretch down low and then whoop, sit down. 
if you want to. I'm going to stay standing so that I can see the computer. So let's start with our first story. Have you been to the beach this year? Hmm. Maybe you can tell you yes or no, whether you remember. I've been to the beach this year. I went camping on the Cape and we got to walk to the beach and it was so beautiful. And actually, we saw what we thought was shark. They put the shark flag up and everything. Everybody was called out of the water. It was kind of scary, but it turns out the shark was really a seal. That was so funny. And the seal was just sort of floating in the ocean. I wonder if we'll see any sharks or seals in this book. Not. But did you, what did you bring along with you when you went to the beach? Maybe you guys can think of a list of things. But let's read our story. And this is read with permission by Simon and Schuster Children's Books. Thank you, Simon and Schuster. I wear my bathing suit and I bring my shovel and pail when I go to the beach. Ooh, they are all ready. Ooh, look at the beautiful umbrella and the towels. We bring our towels and your beach umbrella and tote bag. What color are the towels? We've got a purple towel with green and white stripes, and we've got a yellow towel with green polka dots. <laughs> in, the, in the tote bag, there are cups. How many cups? Let's count. One, two. That's right, two cups. And a thermos of lemonade. Yum. We have two sandwiches wrapped in aluminum foil and two peaches for lunch. Mm. I'm getting hungry just thinking about it. That sounds like a yummy lunch. There is a tube of sunscreen to rub on our skin so we don't get sunburned. I like the way the sunscreen smells. Hmm. Do you like the way sunscreen smells? Little sandpipers run down the beach. I was right, they're sandpipers. Follow them. A sandpiper is a kind of bird, kind of like a robin or an emu. <laughs> My feet make footprints in the wet sand. The sandpipers make footprints too. Do you see them? Do you see the footprints in the sand? Good job. I knew you would. I find some, what's that? Some seaweed. And what are these? Oh, seashells. She finds seashells and seaweed on the beach. Have you ever found seashells? One of my favorite things to do. I build a castle with my shovel and pail. The boy next to me digs a channel where his boat can float. So look, this big ditch is called a channel. Everyone is building something in the sand at the beach. Oh, what else do you do? I see something pretty funny. These kids are burying this man under the sand. And these kids are building a really big sand castle. That's cool. I wade in the water. Uh, a little crab tweaks my toe. And little silver fishies swim past me. Oh. <laughs> I like to walk past the life station to the big brown rocks. Okay, we're going to play a game of I spy. I spy with my little eye. The lifeguard station. Can you find it? Grown-ups, feel free to help your kids find the lifeguard station. You know it's a lifeguard station because there's a person sitting on top of a really tall white chair with a red umbrella and a red boogie board and a life, what is that called again? An inner tube. <laughs> I can't even remember the word for it. That is where the barnacles and the snails and 
live. So did you find the lifeguard station? There it is. And there are the rocks where she's going. When my mother and I go swimming, waves crash on us and get us all wet. A big seagull swims close to us. Then I lie on my towel and dry myself in the hot sun until it is time for lunch. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> The end. Oh, good job. All right. I want to do a song with you or a, a rhyme, actually. And it has to do with five friends who are playing under the ocean. Can you tell me what animal this is? It's a starfish. Right. What's this one? Tell me. It's a crab. How about this guy? What is this animal? Lobster. And a seahorse. And an octopus. All right, let's do our rhyme. And it goes like this. And you can hold your hand up because there are, let's count how many friends there are. One, two, three, four, five friends. One for each of your fingers because you have five fingers. So you hold your hand up and we'll count down on your hands. Ready? Five little ocean friends on the ocean floor. The starfish walks away. And now there are four. One, two, three, four. Four little ocean friends living in the sea. The crab slides away. And then there are three. One, two, three. Can you hold three fingers up? Three little ocean friends looking for a clue. Glub, glub, said the lobster. And now there are oh, two. Can you put up two fingers? One, two. Two little ocean friends not having much fun. Off swam the seahorse. Bloop, 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 bloop. And now there is one. Oh, just one friend left. And who is it? The octopus. One octopus sad and all alone. <gasps> oh no, what's gonna happen? Back swims the, whoop. Back swims the seahorse. Back swims the lobster. Back swims the crab, and back swims the starfish, and they played in the sea foam, safe in their home. Yay! The end. All right, everybody, I want to do a rhyme. I'm just going to put my stuff down. Can you stand up with me and pretend to be a fish? There are lots of fish in the ocean. I wonder if you've ever gone to the beach and seen fish, like the teeny little silver fish in our story that we just read. So can you pretend we're gonna swim in the ocean? Ready? I'm a little fishy, watch me swim. Here is my tail, can you shake your tail? And here is my fin. When to have fun with my friends, I wiggle my tail and Dive right in. Good job. Let's try it again. Can you pretend you're a fish? Let's go swimming through the water. I'm a little fishy. Watch me swim. Here is my tail and here is my fin. When I want to have fun with my friends, I wiggle my tail and dive right in. Good job. Okay. I have another one for you. Can you pretend, do you know what this animal is? What is it? That's right, it's a dolphin. He's very, dolphins are very smooth. I've swam with dolphins before, it's pretty cool. All right, and we're gonna do a rhyme, but can you take your hand and pretend that you're a dolphin too? Who is jumping up out of the water. Good job. 
And let's sing the song together while you move your arm like that. Dolphin, dolphin in the sea. Dolphin, dolphin, wild and free. Swimming, swimming in the sea. Just as free as you can be. Dolphin, dolphin in the sea. Swimming, swimming, wild and free. Good job. Let's try it one more time. And if you want, you can, instead of using your whole arm, you can pretend that you're a dolphin leaping up out of the ocean. Can you do that for me? Grown-ups, you too. <laughs> Ready? Sing along with me. Dolphin, dolphin in the sea. Dolphin, dolphin, wild and free. Swimming, swimming in the sea. Just as free as you can be. Dolphin, dolphin in the sea. Swimming, swimming, wild and free. Good job. Okay, let's read it. This one, do you remember what it's called? It's called Here Comes Ocean. And this is by Meg Fleming. And it's read with permission, once again, from Simon and Schuster Children's Publishing. Thank you, Simon and Schuster. Here comes ocean. I love the illustrations on this. Sun beach, rye beach, pale in hand, found a daughter in the sand. Can you find the sand daughter? It's not an actual dollar bill. A sand dollar is kind of like a little seashell, except it's a living creature. It's just pretty amazing. Cool those toes. What next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. And look, his puppy's off state chasing a seagull. That's all silly. Soft beach. Warm beach. Dig a seat. Something's nibbling on my feet. What is on the boy's feet? Oh, what is it? It's a crab. Pinch, 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 pinch. <laughs> Sometimes crabs do that. You just have to walk out a bit. Oh, there he is. Hide those toes. What next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. Looks Do you remember what these are? Dollars and a crab in his pail. Salt beach. Breeze beach. Look, a track. Pipers chase the water back. Oh, there's those sandpipers again. Pretty cool. They're walking towards the water. I see a feather too. Oh, sink those toes. They're sinking into the wet sand. What next? Who knows? Here comes... Ocean. Low beach. Tide beach. Treasure store. Ropey lassos line the shore. What is this? Do you know what that is? That, you're right. It's a kind of seaweed. Sometimes it breaks off from the sea and the tide sweeps it onto the shore. Splash those toes. What next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. That's the word ocean. Loud beach. Crash beach. Look at the waves. Prickly wall. Sea star clinging to rock. What's the wall? What is this? Right, it's a rock and there's the starfish or the sea star. Plant those toes. What next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. Wow, look at all those beautiful things in the tide pool. 
Maybe you can pause the video later and play I Spy, Grown Ups. Oh, Beach, no, Beach. Better run, giant wave in three, two, one. Move those toes. What next? Oh, no. <laughs> There's a big wave coming. Oh, hang on. The pitch doesn't want to turn. Too much ocean. Too much. Got them all wet. <laughs> Dad and mom are coming to gra grab him now and help him out. Oh, all of his things fell out of his bucket, too. It's probably good for the slow beat. Down beach. Sky grows pale. Stained glass sailors. Purple trail. What are these? Do you know? It looks like little jellyfish to me. Going all the way out to the ocean. Way, way out. Dry those toes. What next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. I think they're packing up and going home. Moon beach. Night beach. Sparkly swish. Wish to point light fish. Wow. Oh, snug those toes. What next? You know. The night ocean. Oh, been a long day. Full of play, huh? The end. Good job. Thank you for reading that with me. All right. I wanted to do a rhyme. Can you get out your five fingers again? And we're gonna pretend that they are fishies swimming in the sea, but a big school of fish. You can swim them all together. And I have, it's the guy, a shark. You're right. So we're gonna do a rhyme. It goes like this. Five little fishies in the sea, teasing Mr. Sharky, can't catch me. Well, along came Mr. Sharky. As quiet as can be, he snapped up a fish right out of the sea. Oh, no, there's only four left. Four little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Sharky. You can't catch me. Well, along came Mr. Sharky, as quiet as can be, and he snapped up a fish right out of the sea. Hey, sharks. How many do we have left? Three little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Sharky, you can't catch me. Along came Mr. Sharky, as quiet as can be, and he snapped that fish right out of the sea. Oh no, there's only two left. Two little fishies swimming in the sea, teasing Mr. Sharky, you can't catch me. Along came Mr. Sharky, as quiet as can be, and he snapped that fish right out of the sea. Do you have one finger left up? Oh, one little fishy swimming in the sea. Teasing, Mr. Sharky, you can't catch me. Along came Mr. Sharky, as quiet as can be. And he snapped that fish right out of the sea. Um, 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 um. <laughs> it's pretty silly. All right, everybody, I think it's time to wrap it up. So if you're sitting, stand as well. We are going to kick with two feet. Let's do it. Can you kick with two feet, two feet, two feet? Can you kick with two feet? Kick, 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 kick. Can you shrug with two shoulders, two shoulders, two shoulders? Can you shrug with two shoulders? Shrug, 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 shrug. Can you nod with one head, one head, one head? Can you nod with one head? Nod, 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 nod. Can you wiggle with ten fingers, ten fingers, ten fingers? Can you wiggle with ten fingers? Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Can you clap with two hands, two hands, two hands? Can you clap with two hands? Clap, 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 clap. Can you wave bye 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 bye? Can you wave bye 
Bye. Bye, 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 bye. And we're going to do our closing song. Put on my ukulele. And it goes like this. All this time we worked and played, worked and played, worked and played. All this time we worked and played, and now our time is done. Wave goodbye to all our friends, all our friends, all our friends. Wave goodbye to all our friends until we meet again. Good job, everybody. Bye-bye. Have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. And tomorrow, Miss Carly and I are going to hear outside the library in the front for our next pop-up library where we bring out goodies. You get to browse and safely um, check out some quarantined library books and other materials and take them home. Uh, I would love to see you tomorrow if you're available from 9 to noon, Saturday, September 5th. And if not, I'll see you online sometime soon. Have a great weekend, everybody. Bye.